Good morning, welcome back to Parsnips and Parsimony. Peter has encampment this week. And for those of you who don't know what encampment is, it's for Civil Air Patrol. It's a summer camp for all of the cadets. And I don't actually know all the details about it. I know that John went to it several years ago and really enjoyed himself. And COVID kind of threw everything off, but they're doing it again this year. So Art went and took Peter to encampment for the week. It's about a three hour drive from here. So John, Peter, and Art are all gone. I'm left with the rest of the crew. It is Saturday and we have some things we need to accomplish today. So I'm running errands with the kids, getting those things taken care of while Art's gone. I have washcloth if you guys are wondering what this is. It is so hot, it is so humid here. <laughs> This is what I do to keep cool right now. We're supposed to have a break in the weather tonight after some thunderstorms come through. So we're trying to get all this done before the bad weather hits. Okay, so first stop is done. If you guys haven't used the Upside app, I will leave a link below. It is a free app, not sponsored. In fact, Charity and my mom told me, you have to get this app, it works really well. So it allows you to earn cash back um, purchases, primarily at gas stations, yeah. but they do have some restaurants, some grocery stores, things like that. So in this case, I don't know if you guys have a speedy speedway or a speedy way where you are, but I was able to use my Speedway card along with the Upside app. So it really helped bring the price of gas. Gas currently is $3.64 a gallon here. So I think it brought it down to close to $3.45. I will take any savings I can get. It's a free app worth getting. It's a shame we don't have a little driveway to connect these two because I have to go <laughs> there for the chicken feed. But there's no through road, so I've got to go back to the main drag and then go over there for chicken feed. Okay, 11 bags of chicken feed. That should keep us for about six weeks. No, kind of. All right, Hannah, let's go. Let's go. You ready? We are at Grandma's and Grandpa's house. They are still on vacation, although they will be coming home shortly. There's a ton of apples on that tree. Look at it. That's a ton of apples this year. Grandpa's not gonna believe it. Yeah, it looks like the bunny's been having a nice little feast. Been doing the nibbly nibblies. I haven't seen grandma's garden since before they left. I just never checked it the day. Uh-oh. Looks like the deer came in and ate. Oh, she's gonna be sad. Yeah, look at that. Something ate the pepper right off. What a brat. Guess that's what you expect. Potatoes look good. Oh, they eat that. It's gotta be a deer. Yep. Look, deer print, right here, right there, and it's fresh too. Came in, <laughs> ate the tops of the silly potatoes. Can you believe it? What? Oh, and they ate part of the vines too. What brats? Yeah. I Look at that. <laughs> but I will say one thing: Grandma's tomatoes look very good, very healthy. Do you see any red ones yet, kiddo? Oh, and they ate the beans. Typical. <laughs> oh, the basil? Yeah, basil. Wow, her basil looks fabulous. Okay, um, just pick off the flowering tops for her because she's not here. So just pinch them off. We'll just leave them on the ground. Maybe I'll scare the animals away. Wow, this look how beautiful this is. Grandma's gonna have plenty for her tomato sauce. Oh. Ooh, I spy the first red, red tomato. cherry tomato. Can more coming. It? Oh no, that's grandma's. Right. There's a couple more in there. Oh, oh grandma and grandpa are going to be excited I when they get home. I just want to eat one. I know. Something there? got in here. Ugh. Something viney, but it died. I don't Caleb, know. There's a perfect plant that will never die. A yeah, weed. weed. Right? So. She's got one pepper here. Were these volunteers? She put three peppers here? That's weird. There's three peppers there. There's a pepper. Potatoes, pep... Now that pepper got eaten. But she's got peppers on these guys. And she got a flower on this, whatever this is. That's another potato. Oh. And that's a potato. Wow. Oh, we forgot this basil. 
this one here. Wanna smell? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> smells so good. Oh, it look, looks like Grandma's got a little lettuce. There's a few that have survived the bunny, and they'll be in time when they get back. Ooh, her, poor carrots. her carrots, well, half her carrots showed up. Oh, she's got a watermelon. Wait, look at that. She she's planted. Watermelon yeah, too? she's got a watermelon. I don't see any babies, but it's growing, so she's that's good. Yeah. Look at that. Grandma's got a potato in there. We'll cover it up so it doesn't get sunburned. Okay. Sunburn. Well, it's true. If it hits light, it turns green, and then you can't eat them anymore. <gasps> look! Guys, look! There's another one under there, too. It's huge! Look at that! Okay. Look over. We don't want it to get sunburned. Yep, yeah, those are red potatoes. Okay. Looks like Grandpa left. He forgot his hammer. We'll put that away for, for Grandma. Was this for Grandma? Alright, Grandma. Mm -hmm. There you go. It's growing. Like huge. Mary's taking care of it for you. <sighs> Even something ate the onions. Poor grandma. Look at your pansies. They're still flowering. Oh, this one's really good. Yes, it is. It looks good. Where did you put the four clocks? Um, you oh, have right one, there. yeah, one back there. It's not looking very happy. I should test the soil. I wonder if it's really acidic here. He's like, nothing's growing. It's really weird. That is a ton of apples. Time for a water break. Chickens are notorious for trying to escape out of this coop whenever I go in to collect the eggs. But we got four. Chickens are starting to molt, which means they're slowing down their production right now. Whoop, there we go. Okay, four bags down, six more to go. I'll put four more in this one coop. We'll have two extra back there, one up here, 
and then I have two for my neighbors. And there are codes on these guys somewhere, I think down there, where you can, let's see, where is it? The Neutrina Perks, I don't see it on this bag. Um, but usually I can enter the codes in from these bags right there. And that will give me more free chicken feed after you buy so many. And we always save the bags for trash bags. So it, they serve dual purpose trash and chicken feed. The rain is coming and we are trying to get the outside picked up. I started these in the refrigerator just before we left. It's lettuce and I think it's cabbage and broccoli. I think, I don't remember, I forgot to label them. But there's, they'll, they'll flood. They're putting it, they put out a flood watch for us. So, stopped what we're doing. We had lunch and now we're trying to get picked up before the rain comes in. It's two o'clock. I haven't heard from Art. He was hoping to be home by two, but I think that's a little un, I don't think that'll work because Peter had to get off, dropped off by two, 1230. And, it takes three hours. So I think we're gonna be looking at closer to three, 3.30, I think. But whatever the case is, rain's coming in. I've gotta get stuff picked up. swim in our driveway. What? The storm that came through, it dumped rain at the rate of 3.71 inches an hour. 15 minutes. He left that oh, so about almost three, oh. Yeah, almost three quarters of an inch. Nice. Are you um, alive? Yeah, no, you guys are a little sore was, from the drive. But it wasn't too yeah. bad. A uh, little aggressive, some people were. Yeah. Actually, but it was pretty well, good. Traffic, traffic was not too um, bad. Oh, that's good. The worst was the a, interchange. You saw a dead bear. Yeah, we actually no! saw a dead black bear. No kidding. Really? Yes. Um, Let's see. It was in Massachusetts. Yeah. Uh, 90. Wow. It was like around mile mark of 6 to 9. Um, 90. Huh? Hannah, what are you looking at? The puddles? You're gonna go shovel the puddles? I know, that's what did good. you do? We cut Mary's. I'll put in pictures of before, before and after pictures. But Mary got her hair cut. We lost about oh, six, seven inches. Feel better? Mm -hmm. Nice comb and cut. Yeah, it'll be easier. That'll be a lot easier for her to handle because it gotten down to it was down well past her waist that was long mm -hmm. a new style for your new 10 year old birthday her birthday was five no seven days ago seven days ago a week ago oh. only a birthday week no not a week for your birthday mm -hmm. there